हेलो स्टूडेंट्स माय नेम इज आलोक सेमवाल एंड इन टुडेज लेक्चर आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट टाइप्स ऑफ फ्लोरीमीटर्स एंड एप्लीकेशंस ऑफ फ्लोरीमेट्री देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स यूज्ड इन फ्लोरीमेट्री सिंगल बीम फ्लोरीमीटर डबल बीम फ्लोरीमीटर एंड डबल बीम स्पेक्ट्रो फ्लोरीमीटर सिंगल बीम एंड डबल बीम फ्लोरीमीटर्स आर फिल्टर फ्लोरीमीटर्स so first type of instrument is single beam filter fluorimeter as the name suggests this type of instrument utilizes single beam of light for fluorimetric analysis this instrument is consist of tungsten lamp as light source and for selecting specific wavelength it also contains an optical system as primary filter Emitted radiation is modulated to 90 degree angle and then it passes through secondary filter and analyzed by the detector. Here this point is very important that primary filter absorbs visible radiation and transmit ultraviolet radiation while the secondary filter absorbs ultraviolet radiation and transmit visible radiation produced by the sample. Single beam instruments are usually 90 degree instruments. They are so called because in these instruments light travels from light source to the detector at 90 degree angle if 180 degree geometry is used then secondary filter have to be highly efficient otherwise both the unabsorbed ultraviolet radiation and fluorescent radiation will produce detector response single beam instruments are simple in construction they are cheaper and easy to operate Here in this picture you can see general layout of single beam filter fluorimeter Single beam filter fluorimeter contains light source primary filter sample cell secondary filter detector and data processor arranged in a well defined manner Here light source produces light radiation which contains both ultraviolet and visible radiation This radiation passes through primary filter which absorbs visible radiation and only ultraviolet radiation falls upon the sample sample is excited by the ultraviolet radiation and it emits ultraviolet plus visible radiation now the secondary filter absorbs ultraviolet radiation and only visible radiation produced by the sample reaches to the detector next is double beam filter fluorimeter In this type of instrument two incident beams from a single light source pass through primary filter separately and fall on the sample as well as the reference solution Advantage of this type of instrument is that it can measure sample as well as reference at the same time It reduces chances of errors produced by the change in intensity of radiation when sample and reference are analyzed separately as in single beam instruments This is the diagram of double beam filter fluorimeter. Double beam filter fluorimeter contains light source, primary filters, sample compartment as well as reference compartment, secondary filter, PMT detector and readout device. light source produces ultraviolet as well as visible radiation this radiation is split up into two beams and the separate beams of radiation passes through separate primary filters which absorbs visible radiation while only ultraviolet radiation falls upon the sample and reference in this picture you can see this light source produces radiation which is split up into two beams one beam is incident upon the sample qubit while the second beam onto the reference cell sample as well as the reference is excited by the ultraviolet radiation and both of them produces ultraviolet plus visible radiation secondary filter absorbs ultraviolet radiation and only visible radiation produced by the sample and reference reaches and detected to the detector most advanced type of instrument used in fluorimetry is double beam spectrofluorimeter 
In this type of spectrofluorimeter, primary filter in double is replaced by excitation monochromator and the secondary filter is replaced by emission monochromator. Work of monochromator is to convert polychromatic light into monochromatic light. They can isolate a specific range of wavelength or a particular wavelength of radiation from a source. Excitation monochromator provides suitable radiation for excitation of molecule, while the emission monochromator isolates only the radiation emitted by the fluorescent molecules. In double beam spectrofluorimeter, incident beam is split into sample and reference beam by using beam splitter. In this picture, you can see a double beam spectrofluorimeter. This instrument contains light source, excitation monochromator, beam splitter, emission monochromator, and photomultiplier tube. Light source produces the radiation which is split up into two beams by beam splitter. Both beams passes through the excitation monochromator which provides suitable radiation for excitation of molecule. This radiation is then incident upon the sample as well as reference. Both sample and reference generate emission radiation which passes through the emission monochromator. Emission monochromator isolates only the radiation emitted by the fluorescent molecules. At last, both beams are incident upon the detector. Detector detects them and readout device generates the result. Applications of Fluorimetry Fluorimetry is a widely accepted and powerful technique that is used for a variety of environmental, industrial, medical diagnostics, DNA sequencing, forensics, genetic analysis, and biotechnology applications. Here you can see few enlisted compounds with required experimental conditions or pH and emission wavelength for their fluorimetric analysis. Thank you.